Looks like they've been pretty fair um, tonight. I don't know if they've towed a lot of vehicles, if any. I know they towed the one that was wrecked. And this lady's over here talking to the police officer. She's talking and moving her arms. I don't know if she's upset or if she's just explaining. But she doesn't look too happy. She's going really slow. Is that is she an elderly woman, I guess? She's going really slow. She's an elderly woman. I don't think she knows what she's doing. How would they have an elderly woman come in here? Yeah, she thought she had to pull out her driver's license. Oh, that's why the lady's here, because the guy in the blue shirt was on the phone. He was walking around in circles. Uh, he probably must have called her to come get him. He probably can't drive. Maybe he doesn't have a valid driver's license. He's not. He's sober. He's not drunk. He's walking around on his phone. So that's why she was explaining. She was saying, I'm here to pick up this guy guy and he walked up to her so she's gonna drive his truck unfortunately her car is parked up there and she's gonna have to somehow come back and get her car I'm sure she's happy about that I do not know why they're here they were parked up at the end Maybe they're just heading back now. Nope, there they go. On a call. They were pulling everything out and putting it in the back and then a police officer got in. They're probably going to lose it now. It's going to be towed. For God knows why. They got all their bags on the sidewalk over here. How come some people, and I'm not judging the police by saying this, I'm just asking, how come some people get to call someone to come get their car or drive them home, yet some get their cars towed and they're sober? They're not being arrested for drunk driving. But they drove their vehicle up there, which means they're going to tow it. Because that's where the tow trucks are up there. Ooh. What's that all about? Our evil Knievels are back. So, I don't know what's going on. Whoever they went after, I don't know if they found them or not.
Maybe the person got on the 71 freeway and it's gone. They're coming around this way. <clears throat> yeah, there's our evil Knievels. They're going to come up to me. Or no, they're not. They're going to park. Oh, there's motorcycles that parked right here. So all the motorcycles are parked over here. Hey there. Hi. Uh, we're documenting what's going on here. And make yeah. sure the police uh, treat everyone correctly and right. Thank you. So make sure just, nobody's rights are violated. Thank you. Yeah, they just stole my car. Yeah, I was wondering because some people get to call a friend. Yeah, my my Come girlfriend. Get their car, my girlfriend. Got towed, my girlfriend I, actually has her license and insurance to drive any car, yeah. and I, they were like, "Nope, sorry," and they just oh. stole my fucking car. Yeah, I saw that. So I, I appreciate you doing this, man. This is like really. Oh well, yeah, it's, no, it's no. fucking necessary. Yeah, especially because if I'm not here that one time, some officer has a bad day and decides to throw somebody down. Absolutely, man. Yeah. Thank you. Do you work for any agency like Cop Watch or no, anything? Well, News Now, you kite us. Okay. Part of that community. Dude, Cop what's Watch your name? Jim. 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 Yeah. I'm Sean. Oh, Sean. Okay. Thank you for doing what you do, brother. Oh, of course. I appreciate yeah, you. Yeah, you know we got to do it. accountability. I know. Yeah. Fucking so, tense out here, man. Oh, I know. That's like I said when they were taking your car. I said, well, how come? Because I don't know the Cirques, but I said, yeah. how come some people get the call? And I've seen people come out here and then get in the car while the yep. driver gets in the passenger. I go, well, how come his They didn't even give me that towed? option. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm like, this one, yeah, that one, no. This one, yeah, that one, no. I don't know how they, <laughs> how they play the yeah. Most likely, yeah. It's, well, anyways, yeah. I, I just, I thought that's what you were doing, and I oh, just really definitely. fucking appreciate you, brother. Yeah, that's why I'm not even putting you on camera, it's just for them, and so. Much love. All right. <laughs> All right, so that was the guy that, the car that got towed. You know, and I meant what I said when I said uh, one of the reasons I do film is for that one moment when an officer has a bad day and he decides to slam somebody, I'm here filming. I catch it. You know, if I'm not out here, then nobody sees it. <laughs> but, yeah, it's interesting that he didn't get the... Uh, he didn't get the opportunity to phone a friend, but we've already seen a couple occasions where people did get to phone a friend. Okay, and somebody showed up to take that couple getting their stuff, so thank goodness he had somebody to call um, to, to put their bags in the car and take them somewhere because their car got towed. Um, like you heard him say, you know, he didn't get the option to phone a friend in the... Uh, and apparently he didn't. I mean, it didn't look that way because he phoned somebody that has come out, but they already towed his car. Yet I've seen other people that have someone come out and they switch and the driver gets in the passenger seat and their friend they phone gets in the driver's seat. So I'm not uh, understanding why they didn't just allow him to do that.
Now this car came down here. I think he went up there and did a U-turn to try to come out here. And they're telling him no. But yet I've seen other cars come through here and turn right right here to go to the 71 freeway. How come they won't let him do that? I mean, nothing's changed. You got somebody that's allowed to drive away. I've seen cars come down here. They stop right here and they turn right and they go to the 71 freeway. Uh, maybe he wanted to turn left. They're not allowing them to turn. Uh, they're not allowing them to turn left here because of the. They want to keep the intersection clear uh, for the the checkpoints. Uh, but um, so maybe he wanted to turn left and they said no, you can't turn left there. But they turned him around when I've seen other cars come through here. So I don't know. So it looks like they just picked up all the cones over here. I think they're going to do that on the other side too. And they're folding up the chairs. Just in time too because the battery on my phone is about to die. I'm down to 26%. They've got a few of them here. But yeah, it looks like they're going to be picking up all the cones. And heading out. So they had a few toes. They had an arrest that we saw. Good on that one lady who passed her field sobriety test. Uh, Bill, I said she had a, a person drive her vehicle. But yet the couple that was here, they wouldn't let... You know, and um, I know that I'm going and uh, I'm going to take people at their word that he said that his girlfriend had a valid driver's license and insurance to drive any car. And I don't know why they didn't let her drive it. There you go. They're going to shut this down for the night. News now, you out here to make sure everybody is treated respectfully nobody's rights are violated <clears throat> although it does make one wonder why one car gets towed and another don't there's still somebody out here uh, they're probably sober and they're just having their driver's license checked because everybody's leaving now including me news now you kaipa Let's get this uploaded for you guys.